I don't want my neighbors to come over. I just turn out the lights and pretend I'm not home. But the Alston and the Shariki singing mice have a different idea. The two species of tawny brown mice reside in the cloud forests of Costa Rica and Panama. Since these two species of mice compete for the same resources, food, and space, they can't live in the same areas. It's known that the mice sing to look for mates and also to drive away enemies, but a new study by the researchers at the University of Texas shows that these singing mice chime in whenever the other one gets too close. Mainly the smaller of the two, the Alston, tends to let his bigger relative have all the space it wants. But still, they're singing mice here, folks. You don't believe me? Take a look. I don't know, Rat, that wasn't so hot. Oh, I love how enthusiastic you are, but maybe this isn't the right competition for you. <laughs> Absolutely horrendous. I'd rather listen to a jackhammer with a headache. Oh. Lucky for us, their song is barely audible to humans, but we should commend them on their diplomatic and deafening problem solving. If you guys had a little mouse and you wanted it to sing a song, what song would you want it to sing? I'd probably have my mouse sing, uh, in the jungle, the mighty jungle. You know that song. Anyways, check out some of these episodes over here. Click them if you want to learn more about animals. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you hairy mammals tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.